Good morning, students. So by now, you should have your sheet of paper with the title on it, the word that you're using, and then your drawing right underneath it as well. Uh, today I'm just going to show you how to take a screenshot, uh, photo of it so we can upload that later. I'm going to be using Skitch, and we've asked for that to be installed, so hopefully you have it. As you see, it says Skitch up here, and it looks like this. The default is always a screen snapshot, uh, and we're not going to be doing that right now. So instead, I'm going to click on this down arrow to open up an options and choose camera. So I'm going to pull up my camera, and there I am. Okay, so now I'm going to hold up the sheet of paper that I need. Try to keep it level. When I have it all in the frame and is level, I'm going to click take photo. Okay, and now you'll notice my lighting is not very good because I have to be in my office. And the main reason for that is because uh, I need the quiet for the video. So try to find a place with good lighting for your photo and click use. Now it's going to pop up and the program does not need my face in there. So over here on the left with the tools, we're going to click on this one that says crop and resize tools. So I click on that one and it automatically gives me some little bars here. I'm going to drag this one down so that it fits and then grab the other corner and drag it up so that I have the entire thing set. And then I hit apply, and you can see we have it done. So right here, now that I have my image, that's got everything I need, at the top, I'm going to click on File, Export. Now as that opens up, you'll see it's going to do something, and then we're good. So your default, if you've never used it before, you might get this view. If you click it, you can expand down. I've put this into Pictures, and then I made a new folder called Erasma LA, and I'm going to call this Word Wall and save over my other one. I'm going to click save, in this case I'm okay to replace. And now I have my image that I'll use to upload to the Erasmus site later on. Alright, that's everything.